Oslo, a city of charming neighborhoods, cutting edge architecture, green spaces, an exceptional harbor promenade, and one more thing, a love for food halls. Hi, I'm Holly, and this is Manny. I work in model and talent development and fashion photography, and Manny works in motion graphics. And together, we have a passion for traveling, food, and we just can't help ourselves to capture it all on camera. During our stay in Oslo, we visited three of their food halls, Math Allen, Oslo Street Food, and their newest food hall, Barcode. All three were clean, trendy, and had a different look and feel to them. They're also great for eating on a budget because Norway's not exactly known for being inexpensive. Math Allen. Opened in 2012, this food destination keeps traditional cuisine alive while showcasing new food trends from at home and abroad. Located in a former factory in Vulcan, an industrial area redesigned as a hub for food and nightlife. Mathalan offers an indoor food market of unique culinary experiences full of cafes, eateries, and specialty shops featuring small-scale Norwegian producers. It showcases the very best of Norwegian and international food, people, and atmosphere. With more than 30 shops, restaurants, and bars, it offers different events from food tastings to live music. I tried a Boston Cream Donut from the Cupcake and Pie Company. I've been waiting for this. <laughs> wow, it's good. And Manny had a fish burger from Vulcan Fisk. Both highly recommended.
street food. Once a location of Torgada Bad, which opened in 1925 as the largest public bathhouse of the time, offering swimming pools, Roman baths, showers, and a spa, to transforming itself and reopening in 2019 as Oslo Street Food. Located in the city center in a neighborhood that has become the city's melting pot and meeting point of diversity, pulse, and space for everyone. It offers a wide variety of food stands and it's the place to experience food from all over the world with drinks to accompany it. With four different bars and 16 food stands serving all kinds of delicious dishes from Mexico, Japan, the Philippines, Thailand, Italy, Korea, the Americas, including Hawaii, Mexico, as well as the Mediterranean, you'll find a variety of unique tasting experiences with a mix of traditional and non-traditional international cuisine, as well as a well-equipped bar. They have an elevated focus on sustainability and social responsibility. They use local food and recyclable materials to reduce waste and energy. Their goal is to create an ethical and multicultural environment, both for the food stall owners and their visitors. Their events consist mostly of their nightlife and different DJs visiting. On Friday and Saturday nights, Oslo Street Food is transformed into the city's busiest nightclub. They remove the tables, dim the lights, and popular DJs help set the mood and transform the old pool into a steamy dance floor. Barcode Street Food. Located right in the middle of Barcode, a newly developed part of the city of Oslo, is Oslo's newest food hall developed by the same guys behind Oslo Street Food. Barcode is a new colorful food hall with 14 different food stalls serving food from all corners of the world and one of the largest bars in Norway. With its warm tropical ambience and a good mix of cultures, serving all kinds of delicious dishes from places such as Peru, Mexico, Japan, India, Thailand, Portugal, Greece, Hawaii, China, Lebanon, and Africa, it offers a great meeting point for different cultures and unique tastes for both young and old, or whether you have two legs or four. Their motto is, come as you are, bring who you want. As far as events go, it's mostly catered to nightlife. The large venue turns into a busy nightclub on Fridays and Saturdays with DJs, disco lights, and dancing. If you prefer a quieter evening, they do have many lounge areas around the venue as well.
if you're visiting Oslo, Norway, you'll want to make sure that these food halls are on your list to visit. See you next time.